I'll tell you what, that is the subject that is crucial because government is too big in Washington, D.C. It's run away. We have no controls of spending, taxes, regulations, no control in the Federal Reserve printing money. So if we want government, it, whether it's medical care or whatever, it's proper to do it at the local level as well as our schools. But there is no authority in the Constitution to do so much of what we're doing. There's no authority for them to run our schools, no authority to control our economy, and no, con no authority to control us as individuals on what we do with our personal lives. And welcome back to Orlando, Florida, where tonight nine presidential hopefuls took the stage to outline their vision for America. And among those contenders, Texas Congressman Ron Paul. He joins me now. How are you, Congressman? Thank you. Doing well. The last time you ducked me, we asked you to be on the program, you and, and I saw you doing an interview right next to me. I'm glad you came on this time. Well, <laughs> I did have another appointment that night, you know, with my supporters. You know, I have enthusiastic supporters. All, the, you have the most enthusiastic so supporters. So, I couldn't let him down. I feel very obligated. But to you him. were sitting right next to me doing an interview when uh, when you were supposed uh, to be here. You know, you have a better memory than I do, <laughs> so I don't recall exactly. By the way, uh, you know where your son Rand is, was today? He was on uh, Air Force One with President Obama. The only time I went on Air Force One it was with Ronald Reagan. Is that right? <laughs> I got to talk to him about the gold standard. <laughs> well, I, well, listen, you see the price of gold? Look, <laughs> you know, I, I was thinking about you. You know, a lot of what you say, the role of government has gotten way out of control. They want to control every aspect of our lives. When you get into those libertarian principles, I agree with 95% of what you say. That's pretty good. All right, pretty good. The, and for example, look at Bernanke and what, you know, QE 5000. And, you know, I don't think it's going to work. Right. I think it's government involvement. Your thoughts on what he was proposing uh, earlier this week? Well, it's just more of the same, and, and that's all they know, and that's all Bernanke knows. If you study his history, all he said, he, he did all his research on the Depression, and he said the Depression wouldn't have lasted if they'd have printed more money much, much faster. But he didn't realize that they printed too much money in the 20s, caused the bubble, and that's how we got the Depression. So Greenspan started it by keeping interest rates too low. That was first QE. Then they had the emergency. Then they had the QE2. And then he said, we're going to keep interest rates very low until 2013. Now he's come up with another one. And the only thing he's ever offered is printing more money. And when you do that, you distort the market. The most important thing in a market is to have prices. Everybody knows wage and price controls are very, very bad. But we constantly accept the notion that the Federal Reserve can fix the price of money, and that's his interest rate. And it is key to the problem. Unless we deal with that, you can't deal with the problem of unemployment and savings and capital and all these things. That's why that's why the monetary issue is so important. You know, if you look at but uh, look at what Obama's doing. Massive government stimulus that fails. Massive government debt and deficits that's hurting the country. Massive regulation. All these things you would fix. And and you know I I think you and and a lot of the people up on that stage tonight were right. The only thing I, f I always find myself in disagreement with you, and I don't understand, I want to really give you a chance to explain this. Why do you think we have no business or role in preventing a madman, Holocaust denying uh, guy like Ahmadinejad that wants to wipe Israel off the map, repeatedly states it, an enemy of the United States? Why do you think it would, we, we shouldn't involve ourselves early before he gets a nuclear weapon? Well, first, we don't have the authority. Second, we don't have the money. Third, it hurts our national security. And fourth, I think it hurts Israel for us to be doing all this. What, what do you mean we, we don't have the authority? Whose author, who's authority? I mean, where, where, where is it right, written in the Constitution that we should be the policeman of the world? It doesn't say that. You, no, you can't do it. Yeah. So, but what we have about, the right what to about defend George ourselves? Bush? George Bush had it right in the year 2000. Mm -hmm. Remember, he said, I don't want to be a nation builder. I don't want to be involved in policemen of the world because he didn't like what Clinton was doing in, in, the, in, the, Kosovo. Uh, in Kosovo. So I'm, I just stick that the founders preach that message. Don't go about the world looking for monsters to destroy. But, but, Besides, we, we don't have the money is the most important. I think that's now. really important. But is it, is it a case that if we don't deal with certain threats now, we'll deal with them later? For example, as we watch the expansion of Nazism, you know, eventually, obviously Pearl Harbor played a big part, but we were a part of, of beating back the forces of fascism and Nazism. Maybe had we gotten in early. Yeah. I mean, do you have to look at potential threats down the road and realize that if somebody says they want to destroy you, you got to believe them? 
Yeah, but that, that's all war propaganda. We did that to oh, go well, into... No, no, Ahmed Dejad says it. He wants to destroy Israel and the U.S. Yeah, but, but so did Khrushchev say that he wanted to bury us, and he had a capability of doing that. Yeah. Iran... Iran is is uh, is not a threat in a true sense of the word. They have a lot of land. Let me finish the sentence. Yeah. They have they have a lot of oil, but they have to import gasoline. They don't have intercontinental ballistic missiles. And and people like others, and maybe you, you're willing to go in there and aggressively attack a country, and they don't even have a weapon. You know why I am, and and this is just the disagreement we have, because when he says he wants to annihilate Israel. His ties, he's fighting proxy wars against Israel right now by funding Hezbollah, Al-Qaeda, Islamic Jihad, the Muslim Brotherhood. They are already fighting a war against us in many ways and Western values, and it's just a matter of us recognizing it. But if we if we had followed George Bush's uh, foreign policy and Ronald Reagan, he said that he left after Lebanon and the chaos, he says, those politics up there are so irrational. Yeah. He said that I made a mistake. He brought the troops home, and he said that if he had been more neutral in that area, those 241 Marines would have been still alive. So Reagan had second thoughts about it, and the founders preached it. And I don't. I think it's going to undermine our defense. I think what we're doing here it may is, not come to that. I, I mean, think I think yeah. we're, what we're doing is very dangerous to Israel. You know, this big fight in the United Nations. What are we doing with the United Nations? Why are they helping us make these Why decisions? Why are we even in there? Why are we funding oh, I'm, it? I'm for getting out of it. They, the United Nations started that mess in 1947, and they've compounded it ever since, and they're still See, we agree again. There we go. Hey, uh, come back. Spend more time with us. Someday. Always good to see you. Appreciate it. Right. Your brother, uh, your, your son Rand is on my radio show tomorrow, so we'll see him then. Oh, okay. I want to hear about this trip with Obama. Oh, okay. Yeah, but that was interesting. All right, and coming up, former CEO of Godfather's Pizza, Herman Cain, is coming up next as we continue from Orlando, Florida. And as always, thanks for being with us.